Equipment's video can come in very handy when solving crimes, but sometimes the footage is grainy or dark or hard to make out. Well, a man in Lexington says a valuable item was taken from him in broad daylight. The entire incident caught on camera clear as day. WKYT's Kelsey Soto is joining us in studio with more on this bold theft. It's our top story at 6. Good evening to you. A small business owner now paying the price for a very costly mistake, and he wants to help others avoid a similar situation. And don't worry, we hear your complaints about any blurry surveillance video, but this is not the case. When I show you this footage, you'll think you're watching an IMAX movie in 3D. I pulled it out, then I actually got on my hands and knees and I opened it up for him and pulled it out. Earlier this year, Tyler Murphy created his own startup business, M Technologies. He fixes, refurbishes, and builds gaming computers. On Friday, someone hit him right in the bottom line. He's obviously looking a little sketch, and that was going through my mind already. Take a look at this video captured by Tyler's Tesla. He's driving up into a business parking lot off Nicholasville Road to sell one of his machines. You can see someone waiting for him. The two get out, they chat, discuss details, and suddenly that person takes off with a big box. Inside is a $1,600 computer. I even offered the gentleman a ride home because it was cold and He's like, no, I'm good. So Tyler immediately contacted police. The business, though, didn't have any exterior footage outside the building, but he was able to provide officers this footage from his car. It's a small percentage of chance that you have to take when you do meet up with strangers on the Internet. And, you know, you have a bad actor, one out of a thousand, unfortunately, and it can happen. Tyler says the person took off through some brush and hopped into a car waiting in a nearby apartment complex. It's an experience that has cost him dearly. Try to vet that person, meet in a very safe and secure location, and just, just like I said, just be careful because, you know, I, I've learned a valuable lesson, very valuable lesson, and it's going to take me a long time to recoup from this. And of course, as you can imagine, the social media profile that was used to make that transaction was deleted immediately after the incident. Now, if you recognize this person or maybe you were in the area at the time and you might know something, you can give Lexington Police or Bluegrass Crime Stoppers a call and they are looking into whether this incident may be connected to any of their other open cases. Bill, Amber. Kelsey, thank you. And Tyler tells us that he has sold more than 50 computers through Facebook Marketplace and has never had a problem. Unfortunately, this time he was in a hurry and let the buyer pick the location. Coming up tonight at both 10 and 11, Kelsey is talking with Lexington police who say thefts like this happen often.